Fiber scan is a very, very useful, novel tool that we have now in our toolbox uh, in uh, taking care of our liver patients. Anybody with any kind of liver disease, fiber scan is a very good starting point. You want to know whether or not I have a fat in the liver and whether or not that fat is going to cause problem like cirrhosis in the future. So this machine actually gives idea about both fat and the scarring. So steatosis and fibrosis. So this is probably best for them but it can be used for anybody with any kind of liver disease. For example, people with hepatitis C, people with hepatitis B, people with other kind of liver disease, fatty liver disease, cirrhosis. Fibro scan is like an ultrasound, okay? It doesn't take more than like five to 10 minutes in most cases. And it's very simple. You don't need any preparation other than just fasting for three hours. On the right side, we have to expose your liver, the liver of exposure in the liver area. So we find that the technician will find the right spot where they can put the probe. Once we put the probe right there in the right position and just press a button, sends vibration wave to the liver, the machine will read the vibration wave, the speed of the wave, as well as the loss of attenuation of the signal, and you usually take 10 measurements and the result is average of 10. And you get the results instantly, actually. It gives like a two kinds of a score. One is called the stiffness score, which is fibrosis score. It comes into number. Then there is another number called uh, CAP, we call CAP score, which is the measurement of the fat. The result has to be interpreted by somebody who is trained to interpret the liver disease, you know, because the score can mean different things depending on the situation. Our doctors are trained for that. I do that myself and other doctors also do. And we just make the recommendations. We can always do liver biopsy for patients with liver disease, but you know, you cannot do liver biopsy in everybody. There's a risk, you have to uh, inject, you have to puncture, you have to anesthetize. There's a risk involved, and most of the people don't like the word biopsy, you know. So this is such a non-invasive, such a simple and easy tool that it can be applied to, you know, to a wide variety of patients right in the clinic setting, you know, point of care. So this is how it is getting popular now. For our patient population, they had to travel. They had to travel uh, like at least one hour or so to get this done until we had this here. As far as in Fredericksburg area, only Mary Washington Healthcare has this, because this is basically for the care of the local population. You know, it's basically, we are trying to provide a better care. So I'm very happy that we have this here.